Another good day on the golf course, your third round without a bogey. Tell me about it out there today. Uh, thank you very much. I really enjoyed another welcoming Scottish day. I, again, barely even noticeable we are in Scotland at all. Conditions wonderful, golf course is in great shape. Um, the water that the afternoon group got yesterday really softened up the green, so you could attack a bit more flags, and it was um, quite fun. Um, yeah, I just I had one chip up and down, which that rarely happens, uh, and I'm just glad I could uh, keep the card clean again, and I'm intending to continue to do so through rougher conditions on the weekend. Absolutely, and you, I saw you went for the uh, the last in two. That can be a Quite a scary thing to do, especially when you ended the last tournament without a bogey and obviously started this one without. There's that water around. Clearly, that doesn't seem to phase you. Well, my caddy, we stood there and it was kind of an inconvenient number because three wood was going to be too much and hybrid was going to be too short. And then he was like, you know what? I don't see it. And I was like, you know what? I don't see a pitch either. <laughs> So then I kind of intended to go to that back bunker and I just ended up just short of that um, and gave me a bit of a tricky chip shot so I just kind of went with damage limitations, gave the putt a good chance but it was a bit short so happens uh, but I mean my layup would have been a nine iron and uh, I don't know that kind of felt wrong <laughs> so I just yeah seized the moment. A wonderful field here this week, one of the best uh, we've ever had at this golf tournament and yet you're right in the mix heading into the wow. weekend. How proud do you feel about your game so far and you know what sort of expectations are you putting on yourself heading into the weekend? Well expectations are always a tricky thing in golf because you there's I mean no two days are ever alike. Uh, I have some goals to just basically stay in the moment and hit one shot at a time because links golf can be brutal at times and you just kind of not like get ahead of yourself is probably like the mentality you want to do and just enjoying another 36 holes out there. Um, yeah I mean there's nothing really more to say. Like, obviously, it's a great honor to compete with some of the best players in the world. And that's what we're doing this for, right? Absolutely, it's what you're doing it for. And if you, you know, post another couple of bogey free rounds, you, you've genuinely got a chance, though, haven't you? I mean, I think everyone has a chance eventually, right? Like, uh, yeah, there's a lot of things that have to come together for an actual win. But um, even if I could just find myself in the, who knows, top 10, top 20 of this tournament after the week, I'll be to me proud and uh, happy to head into a, another Lynx test next week and I'm super excited for this stretch. Well done, great stuff today. Thank you.